Hey guys, welcome back to another follow up video of Infinity X ROM for Redmi Note 8. This time we have version 2.4 based on Android 15. So I have reviewed this ROM many times and I will not go in depth with the features and other things. First of all, let's check what we are getting with the ROM. So as you can see here, Infinity X for Redmi Note 8 and you can flash it on Redmi Note 8 T2. So 2.4 official ROM and the specs and other things you can see here. So the UI is a little bit changed here and it looks good actually. So we are getting Android 15 and other things here the security patch level is 5th of january 2025 so the ui is still same there is no issue at all in terms of network connectivity and other things i haven't faced any issue i did try to find any ui changes here but i could not able to find anything and if you want any kind of customization you can tap here and as you can see infinity is sweet and you get all sorts of customization and it looks good actually the, the ui is changed a little bit and now it looks good and also we do have colors and everything and everything seems to be smoother right now that works really well as you can see here every functions and everything they are pretty smooth so definitely they worked on this rom and it's working great actually and also AOD is there if you want AOD you can turn it on so these are few things here and everything seems to be working fine I haven't faced any major issue here the battery backup is quite good and we are getting charging control and other things but one thing which is not available on this rom is still is that fast charging so it will only charge at 10 watt so it can't go more than that and in terms of security and privacy so we do have both face and fingerprint unlock and both of them work so as you can see here pretty fast no issue let's try face unlock so as you can see here pretty fast so no issue with that as an android 15 based rom we do have like private space and peak and all those things and the notification panel as you can see here looks good no issue with that so in terms of application we are not getting a lot of them we do have dolby at most files and few other applications and i had to install retro music here because there was no music player pre-installed few things i have tried here usually most of the people who are using custom roms they are complaining me about uh, phone calls like bolt does not work sometimes they can't record voice call and all sorts of things and also whatsapp not working so on this rom i did try everything actually usually i do that so phone call section as you can see here i did make phone call and bolt is working as you can see here hd mark and if i show you the call details so as you can see here incoming call 12 second and i did record the voice so if i play it so it is uh, recording audio so that is working so bolt works call recording works and if you are talking about whatsapp whatsapp is also working so as you can see an issue and i did send a message and it is working so in terms of whatsapp and voice call bolt all sorts of things it is working flawlessly no issue and we do have google play protest certification and all the application going to work flawlessly no issue with that so device is certified safety net is there you can use bank application without any kind of issue one thing which i have noticed on this rom is, is that it is pretty smooth actually the experience going to be really really good with this rom it works really well and the feature we have here actually is like circle to search is there and it works a little bit slower side but works without any kind of issue as you can see here no issue with that so circle to search works without any kind of issue now come to the main part gaming so i did play call of duty on this rom but the experience was not really that good it was a little bit choppy in terms of actually the overall rom the ui is pretty smooth and everything is going pretty pretty well but when it comes to gaming this isn't going to do very well the whole gameplay video will be in the end of the video so you can check and if you want to flash this from you can decide beside that actually there is no issue at all only in terms of gaming you're going to have some issue camera works flawlessly everything is working here so only issue you're going to find is gaming performance so if you are a gamer if you play games on your device don't try this rom but if you are a typical user regular user I think this is one of the best ROM you can find for your Redmi Note 8 and the ROM link will be in the description below and that's all about it actually. So thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.